Hi friends, it's Joan at Ten Pentacles Tarot, and today I'm going to review for you a deck called the Sacred Symbols for Divination. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> the Sacred Symbols for Divination and Meditation Oracle Deck by Marcella Kroll. So it comes in this two-piece heavy cardboard box. Um, it's published by Sterling Ethos of New York. That's what the side looks like the end, the other side. The back says, 50 card oracle deck with guidebook created by Marcella Kroll, 2022. Created with the highest intentions, the Sacred Symbols Oracle was designed for those seeking clarity and guidance. This deck can serve as support for meditation and as a path to the magic of sacred symbology. $25.99 in the U.S., $33.99 in Canada. All right, so let's take a look. That's what the inside of the box looks like. Let's look at the guidebook first. So this is a thin, soft cover guidebook. It looks like that. And the back looks like that. Okay. Um, title page. Introduction. There's publisher information. Again, 2022. How to use. Before you begin, take a moment to quiet your mind and center yourself with your breath. Take a big, deep inhale in through your nose and a slow exhale out of your mouth. Allow yourself to arrive in the present moment by creating sacred space with your breath. Doing so lets your highest wisdom and guidance come forward and receive the messages that the cards would like to share with you today. It has a section on spreads. You can do card of the day, three card draw, four card direction. And then uh, it starts with the um, card descriptions. So here's the description of the card. And then um, it tells you about the symbol. So this is the card meaning for you for divination. And then this is about the actual symbol. So we'll do uh, one card reading at the end so you can see how it's written. But it does this for every card. It tells you what the symbol is um, supposed to be. And you have a page, partial, and a, and a partial of another page or so for each card. And it goes like that through all the meanings. And then at the end, we have a section about the author. And she has a podcast called Saved by the Spell. And up there's a picture of her, Marcella Crawl. All right, so that's the guidebook. So let's take a look at the cards. And the inside of the bottom box is the same as the inside of the top. So the cards look like this on the back. Um, they're medium weight to thin to medium weight cardstock. Let me grab one of my um, regular tarot cards so I can show you the size difference. I need to just keep this. I keep saying that I'm going to just keep this deck over here and I never do. I don't know why. Okay, so let's look. This is the Radiant Rider Weight deck. Let's compare the size. So it's about three quarters of an inch wider and about a quarter of an inch longer. So that's the size difference. So let's take a look at the cards. And like I said, they're, they're thin to medium weight. They're very bendy. Um, satin finish. Okay, so number one is protection. Number two, divine masculine. Number three, magic. Number four, new life. Number five, affluence. Number six, divine feminine. Number seven, guides. Number eight, karmic path. Number ten, or Eight, I'm sorry, that was eight, Karmic Path. Number nine, Shift. Number ten, Home. Number eleven, Earth. Number twelve, Relief. Number thirteen, Good Fortune. Number fourteen, Past Life. Number fifteen, Growth. Number sixteen, Trust. Number 17, friendship. Number 18, water. Number 19, transformation. Number 20, divinity. 
21 stormy, 22 grounded, 23 jealousy, 24 focus, 25 truth, 26 boundaries, 27 fire, 28 air, 29 full moon, 30 safe travel, 31 talisman, 32 healer, 33 message, 34 knowledge, 35 gratitude, 36 death, 37 courage, 38 veiled, 39 nature spirits, 40 meditate, 41 time, 42 release, 43 shadow, 44 transmute, 45 new moon, 46 power, 47 lucky, 48 psychic, 49 soulmate, and 50 spiritual cleansing. All right, so let's see how they shuffle. Since they're thin and it's a pretty um, small deck as far as number of cards goes, okay, that can be shuffled easily. Um, they don't stick together. And there are no reversed meanings on these. So even if the cards get reversed, I'm just going to... So they riffle shuffle very nicely, side shuffle nicely. Let's do a quick one card reading so we can see how the book is written. And there it is. The card is number 33, Message. So let there it is. Let's see what the message is. And the number 33 may mean something to you as well. All right, so let's look that up. So you can see how the book's written to see if you can relate to it. It says, a letter, text, email, vision, dream, conversation, music, or some other form of a message is coming regarding your current situation. Be open to receiving it. Meditate on this symbol to draw a message from your ancestors and guides to you at this time. And then it talks about the symbol, which is the lunar, lunar moth. It says lunar moth. I always thought that was called a luna moth, but I could be wrong. Moths symbolically are known for delivering messages, and the size of the moth can indicate the impact of the message. All right, so it looks like a message is coming to you. So keep an eye out for it. All right, friends, you want to do one more? These are kind of fun. Let's do one more. Spirit, what do our, does our viewer need to know today? What does our viewer need to think about or know? There it is. And this card is number 30, Safe Travel. People are getting ready to go on vacation. Let's see what it says about safe travel. It says, a trip, a journey, or even a simple change of scenery is upon you. Meditate on this before you start a new adventure, move to a new home or take a trip. The symbol is called safe passage. Norse Viking rune for safe passage on land or sea also grants protection for those in the air and during astral travel. So that is your symbol, safe travel. All right, very good. So I really like this deck. This has a lot of great possibilities. So that, friends, is my review of the Sacred Symbols for Divination and Meditation Oracle Deck by Marcella Kroll. If you enjoyed this video, if it was helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. It's completely free for you and it would help me out a whole lot. Also, if you hit the notification bell, you'll be notified whenever a new video is uploaded and ready for viewing and you won't miss any at all. I want to thank you for being with me today. I appreciate you more than you'll ever know. 
I hope you have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening, whatever it is where you are. And I hope to see you again soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.